In this video, you will learn how to work with Goldfish's improved map scripts based on CAM scripts. If you are using 3DS Max 2023 or above, you may need to modify the Max script named GTA MAPO underscore FN.MS. Find and remove the text shown on screen and save the file, PB Progress Renamed Skin DFF Names. This resolves a compatibility issue with Binary IPL Importer. You can only import one binary IPL at a time with this fix though. To get started, click the GTA Tools menu in the top of 3DS Max and select Map. Map I.O. Here is a quick rundown of the Map I.O. interface. The game version is important because different versions use different data types. DFF Path is the path to the folder that contains all of the game DFF models. In previous videos, I covered how to extract assets. Texture is the file type that you have extracted to. In our case, we use TGA as explained in the video on setting up texture paths. If desired, you can use PNG or other image formats. Material as. Select the material type you would like imported models to use. Standard materials do not hold the same properties as GTA materials. Import sections. Here you are able to choose which object types to import. Inst is short for instanced. GTA uses instanced objects for things like streetlights and chairs. If enabled, all objects of the same name will act as a reference to one another. That means when one instance model's geometry is changed, every other instances are affected too. GRGE is short for garage. Garages are used in some of the player's houses. Cull is related to cull zones. An example of an effect that requires cull zones to work is ground reflective floors seen in some interiors. Pick is related to pickups spread across the map. An example of this is the minigun that spawns on Kincaid Bridge in San Fierro. Fake import changes object geometry to basic planes on import. This can make it quicker to perform basic actions without having to import the real map into 3DS Max. When you are ready to import, click Import IPL and locate the IPL you would like to import. Binary IPLs, those that are not readable, are also supported. To import those, you need to specify gta.dat found in GTA directory. Use caution when importing multiple IPL files at once. Polygon counts with binary IPLs can easily reach hundreds of thousands of polygons and hundreds of materials which all slows down the computer by a great deal. The map IO works well together with eMap tool. We are not going to discover much of these tools in this video, but you can look around to get yourself an idea of what each button does. The eMap tool and map IO can be used for exporting objects placed within 3DS Max to GTA, IPL, and IDE.